Hi Martin here from MNK Roofing from the Pop TV over in London. Um, we're doing some stitching today. Just want to take you through a video to explain some of the reason why you end up getting cracks above your window arch and with the yellow stock or the red stock monthly in the London properties or various parts of your buildings you'll end up getting cracks um, and you'll be able to see here we've got this at the early stage which is quite good um, these walls, these buildings, uh, they don't have any cavity wall ties. Your cavity wall ties is these headers. Um, basically, these tie into the internal wall. Um, with the yellow stuff, they seem to absorb a lot of water. So when it's raining, you get a lot of water soaked through these bricks. You've got about that much of a cavity, but it still tend to touch the back facing wall. Um, the front face of the cement most of the time the mortar is okay uh, but if we have a look down here just pop off this you will be able to see the mortar turns to dust so the front face is hard but the internal bit turns to dust what this ends up doing is the headers start to move a little bit from the wall internally so then you end up getting cracks on the front of the building and um, there's a few things you could do with this to prevent this from happening you could weather point the front of the building and use a storm dry additive which is like a rain repellent to the mortar mix and then once it's repointed or weather pointed you can add a storm dry to the whole front of the building which soaks through and you can't even tell it's there but regarding this uh, property we can't do that because this has been uh, painted, which is not a very good idea to uh, paint the um, external bricks because these need to breed. Um, and what ends up happening is most of the time, cause the bricks to get a little bit damp because you've got nowhere to breathe. So that's another reason why you'll end up getting cracks also. So what we'll be doing is we'll be grinding this out and uh, stitching it back up, followed by repointing it up and then. Paint it. And that should stop the cracks um, from coming back and um, solving the problem. Um, but I'll take you through the uh, stage by stage process of how we get this sorted. We grinded out all the mortar, ready to install the stainless steel, stitching rods, using the mix. Also grinded out all the cracks. Get the final finish. If this video was helpful, please like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. If you have any questions, just leave a comment below.